I feel Segway is the Samsung of electric scooters. Different versions for different people, different prices, different specs, same good and nice build quality. No cutting corners, just straightforward. Today I chose to unbox the Ninebot E25D, unlock its top speed and talk about its build quality, features and if this is the scooter to get or perhaps you could try getting the Ninebot E22E. This is Raz with Scuderia, welcome back guys, I hope you are staying safe and taking care of you and your loved ones. The box is very nice, with a premium feel and look to it. I really like the way they present their scooters, I enjoy every unboxing from Segway. The E25D comes with a 300 watt motor, a 5960mAh battery that can get you around 25 km with a top speed of 20 km per hour. So they say. Also, the E25D comes with front suspension, a nice touch for your money and also lights under the deck that make riding at night, well, noticeable. Also, the scooter is very nice packed, everything is tight and nice. The scooter itself is of course very handsome. The build quality is exactly how you'd imagine it to be for a good professional company like Segway. So, in the box you will find of course the scooter, the charger, the manuals and of course the screws and the key necessary to mount the handlebar and the handlebar itself. Putting the handlebar on is no brainer, 6 screws and you're good to go. Actually, Segway is the only manufacturer that so far included 7 screws inside the package of every scooter I unboxed. I mean, it is possible to lose one as they are quite small, but if you do, you have a spare one. Great job, Segway! I like the 9 inch wheels, they look nice on this scooter and I can't wait to get it on the road to see how it rides. But this is in another video of course, when I will give you my thoughts about the ride quality, my commute to work and so on. What I also like is the Segway app that is easy to configure and as soon as you connect via Bluetooth your scooter will probably ask you for an update. So after you're done, you can see its full menu where you can do some tweaks. The charging port is on the handlebar's pipe, where actually the battery is also. Now let's see some numbers. So let's talk about speed. As you can see, the E25D has three speeds, topping the 21 km per hour is the red sport mode, but also the normal S mode. Lastly, the normal mode is around 17 km per hour. Weird enough that the two sport modes are reaching 21 km per hour. No need to worry. Now it's time to unlock the speed. So again, for the easy speed unlock you need an Android phone, the Shio Flasher from the Play Store and you're good to go. And of course, I'm only showing you my experience of unlocking the speed of my scooter. You should do it only on your own risk, as I'm not responsible for your actions. Then you will see a list of Bluetooth devices. The scooter should be turned on and disconnected from other Bluetooth connections. Once your scooter appears on the apps list, select it, the scooter will beep twice, sign it has connected to the app. Then select region and some options should appear. Depending on what you want to do with your scooter, you can select from the list. My preferred unlocked is 30 km per hour, select that and then you need to either pay a small fee to the developer or wait and see a commercial after which you can close the page and the scooter will be rebooted and the app will confirm this action.
And there you have it. 26 is not 30 as it says, but I guess it's better than 21. So all in all, this is the maximum speed that this scooter can do. See also my unlocking speed for the Segway 9 Bug Max by clicking on the link above. So that's the unboxing and unlocking the full speed of the Segway 9Bot E25D. I will have a full review coming soon and an unboxing comparison between E25D, the E22E and the 9Bot Max. I will put them head to head to get a conclusion for what I think is the best electric scooter from this lineup. Till then, if you haven't already and would like to continue to see this kind of content, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to stay connected. Till next time, thanks for watching, stay safe and ride eco. Peace out.